Welcome to my channel. Today I have for you a Dollar Tree haul. So I did pick up some items at the Dollar Tree. I bought some food items because they do have food items there. Um, so I just wanted to show you what I picked up while I was out. And then I did go to Walmart as well after that. So I do have some Walmart items too, but we'll stick with the Dollar Tree first and then I'll show you the little amount of Walmart items that um, I want to show you. So. Today I have some fruit snacks that I purchased. We have the Crayola fruit snacks by the Vito. It says 100% DB vitamin C, fat free, no high fructose corn syrup, and cholesterol free. So we have that and they have what kind of flavors do we have here? Blue raspberry, strawberry, orange, apple, cherry, and grape. So there you go. So great good for um, Easter baskets or putting them, put, putting them in Easter eggs for your Easter egg hunt. We also have some Curious George fruit snacks, again by Bebido, and the 100% vitamin C, fat free, no high fructose corn syrup made with real fruit juice. And these are also the same colors, I guess they're since they're from the same company, they have the same flavors and colors in there. Um, there are six pouches in each of these, so pretty good deal, I would say. I did pick up some Glow uh, nail polish. We have these three-piece nail polish sets. So I just thought these were so cute when you want different colors. We have the three colors in here. We have like a a lavender, a green, and a gold. So we picked that one up. I also have this other, I picked up the three that I saw on the shelf. This one has the blue, the green, and another gold, but there are different shades of the green and gold. And then the last one, I have another gold, um, and then we have a pink and a red. So I thought these were really, really nice to pick up, and there's only um, you know, you get three, and they're little bottles, but they could do your nails a couple of times each. So I like that. Then we also purchased some um, vacuum storage bags. So I got the large. I did switch out my um, comforter set, so I have this to put my comforter in. Haven't used these yet, but I hear good things, and it does have the vacuum, um, vacuum little suction. Uh, part on there, so we'll use that. I did pick up the large. There's one in here um, I picked up I think I picked up two larges and I think I picked up a medium and that actually has two in it So um, I don't have that in here, but I do think I picked up the medium which did have two and then I also purchased some power stick three-in-one for men. So I have gotten this for my husband before uh, brand name product and this is 18 fluid ounces this one is the spring fresh and then we have well I purchased two of the spring fresh so that's good I also picked up some let's see, just some uh, sticky notes because I'm working from home um, I would pick these up even if I was working at the at the office so I have some sticky notes to use I also hauled in a previous haul this Lasting Drama by Maybelline, the uh, light liner, and I love this stuff. So I picked up three more. I have it in the corner of my eye right now, and this stuff is awesome. It goes on very smoothly, and it's Maybelline, and it's only a dollar. So I really, I really like it. So I would say if you like it on my eyes, I would go pick it up. And then I also, I couldn't find couldn't find this so well I eventually did find it but I kept looking and looking and in the meantime I figured well if I can't find this let me try this so this is a contour stick and it's a crayon 
but I figured I could use it on my eyes too and then try it for contour, see if I like that. I haven't really contoured before, but I can always try it out. If, if it doesn't work for that, I could always put it in my as an eyeshadow as well. So good thing to pick up, LA Colors. And I did find another one as well. This one's a little lighter, so I figured if I could find the Maybelline, I could use these in the corner of my eye. And again, they're contour sticks, so I might just try out the contour. I haven't, like I said, contoured my face before, but I'll find a video on YouTube and see how that works out. And then I do like having um, uh, I do I love candles, and I've done a candle video. I do like having uh, little tart warmers as well. So I figured I'd pick these up from the Dollar Tree to see what I thought about them. I do have some, um, and I have them from Walmart. I'll show you when I, I uh, pull them out. I do have the uh, pina colada and it. It smells so good. So I figured this one has mango, pineapple, and basil, and bergamot. So they smell pretty good. I'm gonna try these out and see how they work. These are at the Dollar Tree. They have lots of different types, but I figured I'd try these to see if I like that. And then I also found this wall decor. It's from Main Street. It's a wall decor hook. And I thought that was so cute. So I might just um, paint that because I don't necessarily, necessarily like the blue, but there are plenty of different places you could use a hook. So I might just paint this. Uh, to correspond wherever I put it. So I thought that was a good thing to pick up too. And I also, because I'm crafting, and there are different things I'd like to do around the house, so I was trying to, I have some little tea towels that I want to put in my downstairs bathroom. I have some um, heart shelves in there. So I wanted to do the, um, put the little tea towels in the hearts, and I was like, how do I do that? And then I thought about it. And I, I was going to put the um, the Velcro sticky things on there. And then I was in Dollar Tree and they have these magnetic buttons. And I was like, that's perfect. So if I hot glue this to the bank, back of the tea towel, it'll definitely you know stay on the uh, the heart the heart decor because it's a metal heart decor. So. I figured, up, oh, pick up some magnetic buttons, and they're going to be great for when I do that and when I DIY other things. Let's see what else. Oh, I did pick up another um, luminescence little um, tart warmer. I, this one is the lemon lime and then pina colada. So here's another pina colada. The ones from Walmart or I love them. So we'll see how this one is doesn't smell as much and then the uh, lemon lime so we'll try these out and I'll let you know what I think I did find some two little just I figure if I don't have one of those plastic tart warmer cups I could just put it in here and put this on the tart warmer and it works just as well so I got picked up two of those or I could do DIY them and use them for something else so doesn't hurt to pick up those type of items I also found, and my daughter does like to light incense every once in a while, and you can't really smell these, but we have the jasmine and the rose. I actually like this because of the, the little wood thing here, and I could use this on other DIYs, and she can light them if she likes them. Great. If not, then, you know, it was only a dollar, and I, I have these little wood pieces that I can reuse so that's why I picked those up always thinking I'm always thinking about what I can use things for and then I have these two art canvases they are just flat I know they have other art canvases that have the wood on the back um, that is like a stretched canvas these are just uh, one piece crafter square eight by eight inches so if I do something um, I can put this on the back of wood pieces or you know we'll figure out what I can do with it. It feels like it's just got cardboard on the back. So pick those up. But they were a good find. I have a large glue, uh, glue gun so picked up some large glue sticks. These are great. Can't beat them. 
And then I also saw some people haul these items and I thought these, I couldn't wait to find them and I did find them this week. So I found these cutting mats. They are pretty small, but uh, it's great to have these cutting mats. I use an old um, cutting board mat that I have, so these are even better. So I'll use these as cutting boards. And then I do have coastal um, decor up in my bathroom, so I'm not sure what I'll do with these or if I'll do anything, uh, but I have some little wood pieces. We have the whale here and the shell and a seahorse, and there's two of each in here. So I'll see what I can do, and I will have a video of my bathroom decorating and a, t a couple of different things I did to upgrade what I already had in there. So I will show that video shortly. And then we also found some pasta size creamy Alfredo penne. So I picked this up from Kraft. I got two of them. Great brand name, a dollar. Just throw these when you have like hamburgers or um, pork chops or something like that. Put these out um, with that. So it's a great side dish. Pureed bandages. Um, these are the big, they're two by four inches. So I put those up. Again, band-aids are so expensive, so to get them for a dollar and it's Pureed. Can't beat that. I also picked up some, I don't I I was hesitant to pick this Parmesan cheese up, but I did read the ingredients and it is Parmesan cheese, skim milk cheese culture salt, um, and so it's got real cheese in it. So I figured I'd pick this up. It's grated Parmesan cheese from the dollar store. Um, so I'll let you know how it tastes, but I didn't want to pick it up if the ingredients didn't look good and they looked pretty good. So I picked that one up and I know I pick these up and I say that all the time. So just something I do. What else do we have here? Okay, uh, I found these seasonings and I do have another one. Okay, so they had the seasonings there, the body of sriracha salt. So I picked that up. That looks like it could be something spicy. I love sriracha, so I'm excited to see what this tastes like. I also got the red lobster seafood seasoning. So that's pretty cool when you're making seafood put some of this on there. Um, looking to see if they have anything, any recipes or anything. But, um, and then Longhorn, the Steakhouse Grill Seasoning. So I'm excited to see how this tastes. This probably tastes good on hamburgers or steak. So I picked those up. And let's see what else. They have the Jergens Extra mo Moisturizing Hand Wash. I picked this up, Cherry Almond. I love their Cherry Almond um, hand lotion. And I picked it up because I thought it was hand lotion. We were out near the kitchen sink. Winds up, this is hand wash, but you know, doesn't hurt to have some extra. So I picked up two of those. Again, I thought they were moisturizing uh, lotion, not hand soap. I also picked up two items in uh, the planting section or the garden section, this is floral, floral scissors. I have plenty of scissors. I always get my sister, my scissors from the dollar store. They have uh, Betty Crocker scissors, white and red. They are awesome and they're only a dollar and I have about five, six pairs here. So I wanted to try these to see if these work with cutting um, you know, the, uh, the flowers that I might pick up at the dollar store or Walmart or something for arrangements. And then I also picked up the serrated shears. So I wanted to see how they worked as well. Um, so I'll see and I'll let you know, but for a dollar I figured it, we'll try them out and see how these work. And I think that's all I got from the Dollar Tree. So the next group of items are just items that I picked up at Walmart. I did go through the um, and I bought four of these, but I'm already using two for um, my upstairs bathroom. These LED pillar can candles, um, flameless 
and they, they were only a dollar and I picked them up in the clearance section and these are good because I'm always on the lookout for any of these flameless candles that have a timer and these do have a five hour timer on them. It's the best. You put it on when they're supposed to go on, they turn off, you don't have to worry about them. So I did find four of these. Again, I had two up in the bathroom, but I did pick these up for a dollar. So I love going through the clearance section because you never know what you can find in there. Pick those up. And then I also wanted to find some wood letters uh, so I could use these. These are 36 pieces. These are from Platt. I believe this was $2.99. Uh, you never know when you're going to do a DIY and you might need some letters. I do have some signs up in my bathroom or pictures up in my bathroom and in my bedroom. Um, and I kind of want to duplicate them with a, in a smaller... Ooh, you know what I was just thinking? I'm this for that. Anyway, um, I wanted to see if I could just redo them in a smaller, um, in a smaller frame. And I just like the concept, so I want to see if I can do that on my own. Um, oh, one more thing I did find at the Dollar Tree. My daughter needed some um, insoles for her sneakers. So I was going around. They have a bunch of insoles, and I haven't tried them yet. I got two for, and I'm sorry, I don't have them in front of me. I got two for, they weren't a pair. You got one in each for high heels, and they seem pretty good. And then I got this Gel Comfort insoles. So these were only a dollar. There's a pair in here. Again, I don't know how these are going to work, but once I do need them, we don't really need shoes all that much when you're in the house. I have slippers on all the time. So I'll try these out and let you know how they are because even if they, you know, they work a couple of times and you need to replace them, it's easy enough because those type of things, I did purchase some from Walmart for her sneakers and it was about $10 for the pair. So you can get these, these work. I would recommend getting these. I have to try them out first though. Um, another thing that I purchased, and I think you can get these at the Dollar Tree as well. Didn't look for it while I was there. I saw this at Walmart and I knew I needed some new ones because I replace these every so often. Um, a hair stopper. I know, glamorous, real sexy, but we need a hair stopper in our shower, so I figured I'd pick this one up. Um, these are great, so they just sit inside the um, inside the drain. You just pick it up and clean it out, um, and these work really, really well because if you were like us, we, our drains were clogging all the time from our hair. Um, so I wanted to, you know, replace the one that we had, and these are only about two ninety nine, I believe either $1.99 or $2.99, but these, you keep them for months. I just keep cleaning it with my cleaner, um, the cleaner that I use for the tub. And, um, you know, these clean up, but then eventually they just, so I just replace them. So I got two of these. One's in the shower already. Um, I picked up another Waverly chalk in Peacock. Again, I love this chalk paint and I'm trying to, uh, keep a number of different shades in my stash, so I picked this Peacock one up. I did pick up some hand soap. We have soft soap, Tahitian Breeze, and of course I have to smell these when I pick them up. So I really like this one. And then Bright Citrus. And again, these are probably about 89 cents to 99 cents at the dollar store. You can always use soap. These are the um, Max, uh, wax melts that I purchased. So this is the Honeysuckle Pineapple. I haven't tried this one yet. Um, it smells really nice though. So we're gonna try this out. But my favorite is the Pina Colada. And this smells really, really nice when you put it in. It's very uh, fragrant. It really does. And these last for a number, I'd say about two to three weeks actually. You can just keep burning it. Um, which isn't bad, and these I believe are a dollar ninety-nine. My husband needed some hair gel. Picked them up some hair gel. This is his favorite, and then I did purchase some Gorilla Craft Glue. So I do use E6000. Uh, I did want to try this though to see how this works. 
and that's it. So I hope everyone is doing well and they're not going too stir crazy. Um, hopefully, I like everyone says, hopefully this will end sooner than later. Um, I will be doing a couple of videos for um, some recipes that um, we really enjoy. I just, it, I hope everyone has a wonderful Easter and hopefully you can figure out a way to celebrate with your family if you can't be with them. Um, there are plenty of different options out there um, for everyone to try uh, FaceTime and you know all that kind of stuff. Zoom, get your whole family together. I know it'll probably crash on Easter, but you know you do what you got to do. So everyone enjoy your weekend. Uh, tomorrow's Friday, so uh, big thumbs up for that. Stay safe, and until next time, thanks for watching. Bye bye.